<clears throat> well, hi everyone, and welcome to TWF Monday Night Raw, <clears throat> or Lone Night Raw. I, Tony Schiavati, with Renee Young and with Wade Barrett, and today on Monday Night Raw, or Lone Night Raw, we're going to see, hopefully we're going to see, <clears throat> you know, Seth Rollins take on you know, we're going to see Seth Rollins here today on Monday Night Raw or Monday Night Raw, Tony Schiavone says. That's right, Renee Young says. <clears throat> we're going to see Seth Rollins after he had his two matches with uh, Medusa. And they both had cans in, you know, can matches. So we'll see how Seth Rollins, if he's got past Medusa or not. And also knowing if Seth Rollins has gotten past his bind with Medusa over having a Pepsi can match, a Coke can match, and what's next for him? <clears throat> Tony Schiavone says, I'll tell you one thing right now, Wade Barrett says, I don't know what's next for Seth Rollins. If he's put Medusa behind him, he hopefully will be lucky that that he's got Medusa behind him because I hope because she's made a big thing between him and her him being from big lots so hopefully he does put the end to that oh yes I want to welcome everyone to Monday Night Rollins or Monday Night Rollins uh, you know it's one of those cool nicknames that I gave to the show a long time ago and we all know that WWE's Alone in the Monday Night Raw is going back to two spans again at least for three months then when they go to Netflix who knows how long Netflix is gonna have it for but as of right now USA's got it back to being a two spanded show so now you folks have one last thing to bitch or rant or scave about Talking about things that be bitching or ranting or scathing is I had my <coughs> buying with Medusa who's had something against me because I came from big lots. Well, a lot of dolls came from sundry shops. Some of them not even around anymore. Some dolls came from hills, which became Ames, which is no longer around anymore. Some dolls came from Kmart, which is no longer around anymore itself. Some dolls came from Toys R Us and KB Toys, which I guess is around still, but could be dead too. And a lot of dolls came from Game Again, which that's no longer around. Other dolls came from the Vinlander Frith Metal. Some came from the Glassport Frith Metal. I mean, a lot of them came from Amazon or Strong Woman. But anyway, some came from all these too, don't forget that. And some dolls came from five and below. So whatever ground, sick or wise, Medusa has had it out for me because I happen to come from big lots. Well, Medusa, your first doll that got bought in the 12th month, I believe, of 20, at the end of 2006, between us while, came from Game Again, right? And the doll you've been fighting me as came from Strong Woman back in 2021 while, right? So, the way I look at it is I'm done with you. And, oh! Is that right? You said you're done with me, Seth Rollins. Not done with you, big lot. Yeah, your first dolls came from Amazon or Strong Woman. You got other dolls that came from either Walmart. I mean, came from Big Lots. Same, some came from Ollie's, whatever. But the last one of you came from Big Lots. Don't talk about Big Lots or Ollie's or Five and Below. Or Walmart, because you came from Big Lots. Fuck you. Oh. We're not done. You see, 
this pumpkin or whatever the English word is for it. I got that from Walmart last Tuesday. So, guess what? I'm now beating the shit out of you with it. How you like that? How you like those apples? Well, we can make a guess that the bind between Sephiroth, the war, the wrong between the war wrong between Seth Rollins and Medusa is not over at all, Tony Schiavone says, but most likely it's still going on. <clears throat> and I wonder what either <clears throat> the overseer of leadership, Astronoma, or the main overseer of TWF, John Bradshaw Lakefield, is going to do about is going to do about it, Tony Schiavone says. Well, I wonder if we're going to get a match here today on today on Monday Night Raw, Tony Schiavone says. Well, I hope so too, Renee Young says. That good knows that the war, the bind, or the wrong between Seth Rollins and Medusa is not over, Renee Young said. No, it's not at all, Wade Barrett says. It's not at all. You know, it's not over at all. Not over from a long shot. Wade Barrett says, and I wonder what John Bradshaw Lakefield is going to say about it. Get that in the ring. All right, Medusa, I need you down here now, because I can see you're a mishap maker. So I saw that little that stunt you did. Shit. I saw that stunt that you stand up. Oh, I saw that stunt you did when you hit Seth Rollins in the head with that pumpkin or whatever the English word would be for that, you know. So I guess having the match with a Pepsi can and a match with a Coke can wasn't good enough for you. So now you got to hit him with that. So that gives me the thinking. Since Halloween Havoc or Hallow Evening Madness is going to be on... Thursday this year, which would make it be on impact or hit. And since we already got Wonder Woman and Chris Jericho fighting in a stunt or fleet match, how about we fight in a great pumpkin match? Or the great whatever you want to call it. Whatever the English word is for that. Oh, is that so, John Bradshaw Lakefield? Well, thank you, because I'm not done with that creep. Since he got fought by, that he got fought from Big Lots. Yeah, and I came from the cell, and I came from the helping fighting arm. You know, give and thrift shop. So I guess that makes you greater than me then. We're doing that match now. Oh! What the? Okay, now, get a fight lord in here. Standing, we got a match going now. And I believe now, now Seth Rollins is going to have to, you know, somehow, some way, hit Medusa with that pumpkin or whatever the English word would be for that. The tin end of his English, but the beginning of it, either Latinus or a French borrowed word. And Seth Rollins is getting on top of the, getting on top of the squash, and oh! It's over. Seth Rollins has took care of Medusa. And that might not be good enough. He's going to get on top of the squash again, Tony Schiavone says. Well, did you know one thing Renee Young said when Charles Brown and his friend were yielding out one night to see if the big squash would come or not, the great squash would come? They wouldn't think that Seth Rollins was going to be on top of it curve coming down and, and and landing on medusa renee young said no i don't think so wade barrett says i don't think it either came to their mind that that was what they were yielding for that night or what lioness was yielding for that night and everyone said there is none and then someone came along and made one to make him feel happy 
But even if there wasn't one, you wouldn't think there'd be some wrestler hopping down on top of another wrestler on, on a squash. Way Barrett says, one, two, three. Ding, ding, ding. Here is your, here is your winner of the great squash match. Or smash match, Seth Rollins. Well now, hopefully this time Medusa will leave Seth Rollins alone. Because hopefully this time, you know, hopefully this time Seth Rollins would have gotten, you know, the upper, would have gotten the upper hand on Medusa and not have to worry about her anymore. Well, Tony Schiavone says, well, I hope so too, Renee Young says, because Medusa still hates Seth Rollins for coming from Big Lots, Renee Young says. I came from Big Lots, Renee Young says. I came from Walmart, Way Barrett says. And Tony Shavali said, I came from Amazon, or I came from Ringside Gathering. So, does that make, does that mean that all three of us are greater than Seth Rollins? Get out of here, Tony Shavali says. It does not. No, it does not, Renee Young says. Not at all, Wade Barrett says. I don't know where Medusa's getting off that, though. All right, thank you, <coughs> Tony Schiavone, Renee Young. I'm going to be talking with Seth Rollins here today on Monday Night Raw or Monday Night Raw. Seth Rollins, you have, hopefully, you and Medusa have finally brought an end to your to your war or to your wrong well i hope the wrong or the war between medusa and myself is over because how many times can you wrestle someone in a pepsi can match or coke can match a great squash match i mean you would think that medusa would give it a rest already with oh i came from big lots well think of it joey styles a lot of dolls came from sundry shops I mean, you came from Walmart. Yeah, I did. But does that make, but, but that would make, that would mean in Medusa's eyes, you were greater than anyone who came from, I don't know, all these or five and below, or anyone that didn't come from Kmart or Hills or Ames or whatever. Well, the truth is, Joey Style said, I doesn't really care which shop or online sh on shop or interweb shop that one happened to come from but hopefully your war wrong with her is over yes it is i believe it is i believe that i have put the medusa i am done with her i mean a lot of folks like to bitch and rant about you know how you got booking and writing it has a beginning middle and end and how some folks want you to speed through everything some folks want you to take your time other folks say you're not enough of it. Well, let's just say that this time around, I'm hoping I'm done with her. She wants to make her name for herself. She hasn't gotten over at all since she's been in the toy wrestling gathering since 2006 between FYL. That's not my bind. And starting shit with me is not going to make anyone fear Medusa. Or get her over as one of the evilest followers of the 4-1 Bonds of Evil. Or whatever the fuck her bind happens to be these days. Well, hopefully your war, your wrong between you and Medusa is over. Well, I hope it is too. Because I got bit other goals. And it does not happen to do this war and this wrong between me and her. Well... That's my talk with Seth Rollins. Back to you, Tony Schiavone and Renee Young. Thank you, Joey Styles, for talking with Seth Rollins here today on <clears throat> Monday Night Raw or Monday Night Raw. <clears throat> That's all the time we got here. I, Tony Schiavone, with Renee Young and Wade Barrett, we hope you like Monday Night Raw or Monday Night Raw, and we'll see you tomorrow for NXT. Thank <laughs> you.